Hey guys, it's me, Marcus, and today I'm going to show you how to make Chaya Thai. Now this Asian fruit cocktail is so creamy and refreshing and unique. It's the perfect dessert to bring to summer events like barbecues and potlucks. So let me show you how to make it. You should be able to find the ingredients for this recipe at your local Asian grocery store. So here I have a can of green Ayu jelly, sugar palm nut, which is like toddy palm seeds, jackfruit, long yin, nata de coco, which is coconut gel, colored tapioca pearls, and half and half. Okay, so let's start off with our green Ayu jelly. Now I love this stuff because not only is it super tasty, but it changes the half and half to this gorgeous milky mint color, which I think is really cool. So as you can see here, I'm using a knife to cut up my Ayu jelly into thin slices. I like this method because it creates for fantastic textural contrast. But feel free to cut it any way you like. So now let's work with our jackfruit. If you're unfamiliar with it, it shares the taste of so many delicious tropical flavors. Here I'm cutting it up into small pieces and I advise you to be careful because the jackfruit's flesh can be a little bit tough. Here's my favorite part about chia thai, nata de coco. These translucent little cubes ooze out coconut water when you bite into them, and they're so good. Our next fruit is long yin. This fruit is the perfect balance between tart and sweet. Here's our sugar palm nut. These may be firm, but they have a really delicate sweet flavor. I've also cooked some colored tapioca pearls, and I will have a video coming soon on how to cook them. And as you see, as I was trying to display the texture, my fingers got kind of stuck, but there you go. Okay, so now I've separated the fruit from the juice, and I'm just taking the cut up and prepared pieces and putting them into a strainer. And I'm just going to rinse them under cold water to get rid of some of that excess sweetness, since we're already adding some of the juice back into our mixture. We're almost done, so now I'm just taking all of my prepared fruit pieces, adding them to a trifle bowl, and adding some of the juices from the cans into that as well. This is up to your discretion which kinds of juices you want to use and how much, but I just do it to taste. Now stream in two cups of well chilled half and half and give the entire thing a really, really good stir. And all that's left to do is serve. I'm just taking it and dishing it into some cute clear glasses. Oh, I spilled there. Well, oh, I tried. And then I'm just going to top it off with a spoon, straw, and crushed ice, and you're done. That's it. If you want more videos, please like, comment, rate, and subscribe. Enjoy!